Hey guys, it's me, Army of War. This is the Raspberry Pi 4, um, one gigabyte model. So what I'm doing is I'm playing a bunch of 4K tests for you today. This is what I have um, set up right now. I have the Raspberry Pi with a fan on it, and I'm basically tracking its power output. I will get to you on the next video when I'm doing a uh, Raspbian OS. All right, so we're gonna get towards the test, which everyone kept asking about. I don't know why, but uh, I'll do it. But, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna play Big Bunny and 1080p, and we're gonna see how that goes. We're not gonna watch the whole thing, but we're gonna go through it. I'm gonna move this back a little bit. <clears throat> As you can see, it's running just fine. Of course, it's 1080p from it's, it's a big jump from what it's doing. You can see how it's running just smooth on my television. Play a little bit more. Now, there is something I do want to talk about. On the Raspberry Pi 4, it gets excruciating hot. Um, it gives off this new burning smell. You know, that as you, you know, when you burn your speakers, you know, you burn off that new burn spell, smell. That's what it smells like. So I recommend a fan on it to keep it smooth because if it overheats, it does start throttling after a certain uh, temperature. All right, so we're gonna go to Big Buck Bunny 4K, 60 FPS. As you can see, it's behind, it's lagging. I don't know if it's my problem. I do have a fan on it going full force right now. As you can see, it's, it, it does not like this video. All right, so we're gonna play Big Buck Bunny native size, and that's like, oof. And the thing that I don't understand, <clears throat> it plays the native one a little bit better than the uh, 4K one. But as you can see, it's still struggling. But then, then you have to think about this is the first build for Cody. All right, we've seen enough. We see how fast it's going. All right, and I do want to play the LG OLED 4K demo. As you can see, it's running it just smooth. Um, I don't know why it plays this 4K demo just fine than the others, but that's something we will get on in the next video when we're playing Raspbian. And this is plugged into the USB 3.0 port. I don't know if this is just my problem with the Raspberry Pi one gigabyte model, but I will try this with the two gigabyte model. But as you can see, it's stuttering and skipping and you know whatnot but it can totally handle it it's just more optimization i'm going to show you what i'm currently running right now <clears throat> let's see where my settings this is the current build that i have right now and as you can see hold on where is the power output uh, here go to system information you can see if I'm using up anything. As you can see, the CPU usage is not um, throttling out. Uh, I still have video RAM to spare. That's the information and the hardware. As you can see with the fan on it, the temperature is at a decent uh, 115 Fahrenheit. And the current build of this right now is, where is it? about it's version 9.1001 now this came out for the raspberry pi first 
and I tried it out and it looks like it's going to have some promising uh, things when it updates and gets all the nice little quirks out. But if you do want to see a video on Raspbian, drop a like, comment, and subscribe. All right, everyone. See you later.